hello professionals and students let's welcome back another important tip from my side real time how to change the tr tr or also there is shortcut transport requests one or from one to another okay so for example tr suppose you know that we have two kind of uh, requests one is workbench request and another one is customizing request i already explained to you in my previous videos suppose if it is on your name how to change it i will show you the place uh, where uh, it's supposed to be okay so but we have to make sure that this is at your end in uh, your real time system it is a practice system then i cannot help you out more on this but i will show you the place where you can able to change it okay whether it is ecc system or a Before getting into session, I would like to tell you this is my Udemy profile. My name is Jagdish Kumar Raidu. I am SAP SDS for an a functional architect. You can able to see sales and distribution, and you know other set of courses and ECC and S four HANA. I am just providing these links below of this video. So this is ECC course. My top course eighty three hours. Apart from that, this is four point seven highly highest rated course. If you don't know anything about till now S four HANA, you better do this course. You will get some ideas, some questions. You will get on business partners. And if you're still interested, few more courses available. So if you are not at all, not at all introduced to real time, very beginner, or else you're new to the industry for SAP functional. Getting master to write functional specification, either ECC or S4 HANA or else MM, ASD, PP. You can follow this example section by section. I explain. You better go through this course. And this is for for my pricing. This is one of my topmost course. One twenty one successful reviews, four point six rated. And another course recently I have introduced you. So to cover advanced level of topics. And if you can able to see rebates and you know other stuff of courses available. Okay, if you like this video, you uh, better subscribe it, my channel, and uh, let's get into the topic quickly. You know that uh, whenever you create any request, it will be saved in two forms. One is a workbench request, and another one is transport request. Let's go to SC zero nine. Okay, so let me show you. any existing request let's go on display okay so for example this request is there i'm just showing you but uh, here it's a test system where i have taken outside you know, to do my configuration for example this is the owner is uh, you know 31 user 21 if i would like to change it just select it you remember this button change owner you click this button now you can able to give any uh, another user actually For that matters. So if I want to change, I can able to change this TR to another username. Let's try, but it won't work because uh, let me make it this guy. So now luckily it is got changed, but it's not the fact. For example, if any transport request created by you on behalf of your colleague but actual work done by him so that you know it will be changed by from your name to him or else your her name to you or else you can able to change parallelly this is how you can able to change the transport request let me try to change it back okay this is how you can able to play with the system i think this is something useful to you if you are not, if you are not yet subscribed please subscribe my channel knowledge will be driven when you share this knowledge please share my videos and ask other persons to listen and have that comfort in real time okay i think you got it some useful information today i wish you all the best jai hind